Well, the Athos is, is, is quite an amazing bike and it's a very different bike for Specialized. Uh, this time it was more about the ride, not necessarily the timed ride or winning the ride, but just making the bike with the, the best ride characteristics and not having to comply to UCI rules with weight limits. It's just, I think, for, for our collective team, it's been like a, a liberating feeling of not having to be having your head in the vise and say yes UCI, but rather just making a, an, an amazing product that we can be really proud of. We have the opportunity to work with Chris King and some of their really cool new component like colorways that are coming out for hubs and bottom brackets. So we are taking the new ethos and stripping it down and giving our custom story to go with those new Chris King components. The inspiration behind this bike in particular really came from the inequalities that I see as a woman working in the cycling industry. I was really inspired by Beyonce's Black is King album. Taking bits and pieces of this really strong feminine energy and the messaging of equality between race and gender I think is really important. 300 things that I promise to all women in and out of the cycling industry. I promise to make his story her story in cycling. I promise over and over again to make a difference. As women continue to fight for our place in this world, I promise to use my head and my heart to continue to fight for equality. I promise to you I do not want to be one of the boys. I want to be one of the women who made a difference in cycling. So it's really an improvisational act. Just like any other piece of art that gets created, it's going to be perfect when it's perfect. I might have been there half an hour ago, I might get there again in half an hour, I don't really know, but you know, it'll take me a couple of hours to paint this bike, paint it. Most bikes, in my eyes, they just tend to look the same and they're perfect, they're like renders. The production methods are just exquisite and you, there's not a single flaw and I, I just felt obliged to do a, uh, a more jazzy version of, of a paint job and paint the bike with, uh, with cellophane or make a, make a one dollar paint job basically painting, painting with this. It's a really fun process. It turns out to be a really fancy paint job, but I feel like a child just painting this right now. I think it's, it's liberating. It's like free jazz. It's just, it, it's, it just keeps on going. I'm, I'm in the groove here.